YouTube, what's going on, baby? It's your boy Blood Raw back at you once again with another quick video. Remember to make sure you like, comment, and subscribe, baby. Make sure that post notification bell on so you will be alerted every time I can tell you to drop that. Ah! Throw ice on my YouTube channel, baby. Let's go! This video here, man, I'm gonna have to break this new CERN information I came across down to y'all, bro. What they are basically doing, man, they are in the process, the process of merging two worlds together, man. That's what the fuck they are trying to do, bro. You got to look at it like this. The Bible, a lot of the Bible explains to you at the end of Revelation about CERN. Like with Apollyon, you know what I'm saying? As far as with the entities, that's like, you got to think about it. In scripture, you see how the Euphrates River is drying up. You got to understand. Go research about the Euphrates River and how that ties into scripture when it goes into correlating with the Bible, the word of God. You got to understand in the Bible, it tells you in Revelation, when Euphrates River dries up, the four fallen will be released. Basically, the one they are being held bound. But once the Euphrates River dries up, which this damn near dried up, you got to go research this shit. It's like a lot of it, they try to say conspiracy theorists and all that there. But if you look at it as far as on a Bible biblical standpoint, it's lining up together. You know what I'm saying? And that's what turned them with Apollyon, which represents Shiva. You know what I'm saying? In the front of that building, what Shiva is holding, that statue that's standing on the baby skull that I explained in my previous video, she is holding a portal. That's what the fuck she's doing. So what these motherfuckers are doing, they basically are shooting particles at each other at a high rate basically trying to just open up a whole nother dimension so these beings can cross over. It's like everything plays a part in its own timeline when stuff has to be fulfilled when it comes to Bible prophecy. And now it depends on what you believe in. But if you have read the Bible and understand the Bible, a lot of the context scriptures in there, it basically, a lot, especially right now, what's going on like with the Euphrates River thing, that's thing got stuck in my mind a lot. You know what I'm saying? Because it's drying up. And what these motherfuckers from CERN is doing, you know what I'm saying? It gives you all of it. Go read in Revelation. It's like Revelation 9. I mean, chapter 9, like verse 10 through like 19, I believe. It'll tell you about like, it. if you got a lot of understanding, you can understand context. You can peep and put, piece all the pieces with CERN, the Euphrates River, and everything what's taking place right now in society on a whole timeline you know what i'm saying i ain't trying to lose y'all your mind got to be open to understand a lot of this shit you know what i'm saying but if you feel like you're a highly intelligent individual you can break this shit down too you know what i'm saying and piece it together and these demonic motherfuckers as far as dealing with cern they are willing basically to lose put their own lives at risk you got to think about it whatever they doing which i'm explaining to you what they're doing when it comes forth it's gonna murder their ass whatever 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 you know what i'm saying you got to go read this shit these folks are basically ready to just sacrifice life man they don't give a fuck man for the agenda at hand and then check this shit here out though bro they're trying to say they want to really rebuild the georgia guy stones and re they want the world's population down to five million people not 500 million. Boy, these motherfuckers is crazy, bro. But anyway, back to the sun as far as lining up with the revelation. You know what I'm saying? You got to think. Go f research about the Euphrates River. Excuse me. And with scripture, man, it's li it lines up perfectly, man. You got these four fallen, you know, demons that's supposed to be bound. They already saying they had a video out. It's on YouTube. Well, you can go, they got a, somewhere on the, at, at the Euphrates River, they got this hole that you can go listen and you can hear the damn demons down there just like, it's a crazy eerie noise. You gotta go research the information, I'm telling you, man. Open up your motherfucking mind. Don't be just scrolling on your phone, being distracted by all this dumb shit that don't even matter. 99% of the population scrolling on the phone worried about shit that even ain't even bringing them no money, which the money don't even matter anyway, but you gotta understand the concept of what I just said. 99% of motherfuckers scrolling their phone and the phone ain't making them no money. They're putting time and energy into the phone, but it's not bringing them no type of elevation. You feel me? No type at all. Just worry about the next motherfucker's life. Want to look pretty and cute. 
and not even understanding what the real fuck taking place. That your own motherfucking system is trying to starve you out, release demons, open up portals, all type of shit. Cross us over and just, I'm trying just to storm motherfuckers' lives on a whole bigger scale. And motherfuckers ain't even prepared or ain't even got food, man. I'm talking about they ain't even got food. They are so dependent on the system, bro. So the shit is motherfucking sad, bro. But I ain't gonna make this video that much longer. I just go ahead and come in there with that little piece of that information about the sun and how these motherfuckers study colliding these particles. Basically, they, 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 man, let me tell you something, man. I ain't no telling what the fuck these folks are releasing. But go read the revelation, man. You know what I'm saying? It's there. The information is there, and you can see how it lines up to what these people are doing, man. Go break, you gotta get the text and break it down and go go get it translated, go research. You gotta put in the work, go look for it in Hebrew, the translations and all that, man. It, it got, it's, it's there. I'm telling you, man, put in a little work. You can find out a lot of shit, bro, I'm telling you. I'm telling you. And you should wanna know, man, you can't just be sitting back with your head in the motherfucking clouds, bro, especially if you got children, those that you love, and if you know you if you are finding and learning information, you should want to keep finding that shit. Let me go see for myself. Let me, I'm gonna start trying to find me out some shit too. And you gonna want to know. Cause shit can hit the fan at any moment, man, on all type of levels, bro. You know what I'm saying? You gotta think about it. What what they are doing with CERN, they are, you only can see, us as humans can only see 1% of the magnetic light spectrum. You know what I'm saying? As far as with our eyes. So just think about what's around us that we can't even see. So what CERN is doing, they basically trying to merge that together where you're going to be able to see basically a lot of what you can't see. Like they're trying to basically bring that percentage up. You know what I'm saying? Is that making any sense to you? Think about it. If we only can see 1% of the magnetic, magnetic light uh, spectrum as humans, that's why cats and animals can see what we can't see. See in the dark, all that shit though, that we can't do. Because we only can see 1%. Adam see on a whole nother percentage. So what CERN is doing, they be uh, colliding these particles, trying to bring that percentage up. Just say, directly speaking, just say 30%. You will be able to see all type of shit standing around you that's been there your whole life since humanity been created that now you can actually see individual with your eyes now. That's what the fuck these motherfuckers are doing, bro. I'm telling you, bro, this shit is on a whole nother level, man. But I ain't gonna make this video much longer, man. Remember to make sure you hit the like button. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to everybody. I hope you still staying highly vibrational. You know what I'm saying? Elevating your state of consciousness and just getting the information, man. Preparing yourself, man. I hope y'all still preparing. Getting them canned goods, them bags of rice, beans, them cases of water, medical supplies, sleeping bags. Get what you can, you know what I'm saying? Shit still cheap. Hit them dollars so you see some some good blanket. Put that shit to the side. Grab you something. Don't be spending your money on all this bullshit. Yeah, still enjoy life. But at the same time, if you ain't got shit stashed back the way, when the shit takes off and hits the fan, yeah, it's going to be fucked up, bro. Yeah, it's going to be fucked up. And I hate to say that, bro. I hate to say that because, boy, I know just like Big Brother know and the government know that the average American ain't got not even 30 days worth of food in their fridge and in their homes because they have been so conditioned to the fast food world and they gonna starve y'all the fuck out. Man, it's your boy Blood Raw until next time I'm out.